Good morning, everybody. Today, I would like to show you something I've added to my Nissan Leaf that I think can help me in improving the charges that the car can retain. Uh, most of us that use Nissan Leaf, we all know that gasometer calculates the miles that you can cover depending on your driving habit and the energy in your battery. If you're driving very fast and you have certain amount of energy in the battery it will tell you hey you can only drive this range but if you reduce the rate at, at the speed at which you're driving it will tell you you have longer range yes but at the end of the day some people drive very slow and think the car will retain more charges that way no it will not what I think will help everybody is this little device this mechanical device that can actually unplug and plug back the car when the car is fully charged if you unplug and plug it back it will top it up a little bit and then go off if you unplug and plug it back it's going to top it up a little bit and then goes off i'm starting this and i hope it's going to help me and that's why i've just introduced this guy this mechanical device mechanical timer to help me in doing that i set it in such a way that at every 15 at every 30 minutes it will be on after 30 minutes 15 minutes off 30 minutes on 15 minutes off 30 minutes on and i want to see how it's going to help me then i'm going to continue the video when i see the result i'm plugging into the wall and another thing i would like to add is that this one that i have is two 40 volt rated it is downward compatible which means it will work with 110 volt but the one for 110 volt i don't know if it is upward compatible to work with 220 volt my evsc which is at that corner my evsc will work with whether 110 or 220 volt and i'm on 220 right now and that's what I got. Please like, share, and subscribe. Have a good one. Bye. Yeah, to continue on what I'm trying to do. Right now, the car is fully charged. And uh, it's still plugged. But I want to top it up a little bit. So, what I will do is unplug. And then plug it back. When I plug it back, I start charging start topping again okay so with that I'll go back inside and check my trusted Nissan leaf spy okay what do we have uh oh I can't see anything can someone see something okay I can't see okay I can see something okay it says 95 Point seven state of charge and uh, oh, it's still doing something. Let's see. Oh, let's press this button. One, two, three. Yes, here we go. So minus. 35 watts going in so it's hiding hiding something okay 95.9 percent .9 state of charge right now is at 19.6 kilowatts yes which is good so we've got more going in minus 4.6 watts how going in uh, and it's giving me an estimate of 84.3 miles Okay, with the way I drove and with the energy in the battery it's giving me an estimate of 84.3 miles as my next estimate which is not really bad, but okay that kind of estimate is okay so what, what are we looking at here you can see that 95 point something has changed to 96.0 state of charge so it's climbing bit by bit 
before I came here this morning the car was already fully charged so just unplug and plug it back bump it up a little bit and that will give you additional very small most time by something you can see that 19.7 kilowatt going up it was 19.6 is now 19.7 kilowatt you see 96.1 state of charge is going up yeah it's going up so that was the reason I put the mechanical um, device mechanical timer on my power line in between the power line to cut off at 15 minutes for 15 minutes and then put on let power through for 30 minutes this is why I did that and seriously it's helping it's improving the rate at which the car can actually retain more charges you can see it growing you can see it growing by the time it cut off it will rest at that boat it used to just stop at 90 90 92 percent state of charge that's where this car used to charge up to 92 percent state of charge and you can see it growing up to 96 percent state of charge right now and not only that the more energy i have more energy in the car i have up to 19 kilowatts 19 kilowatts it used to stop at uh, probably 16 17 18 but you can see it's it's the mechanical timer is helping and is making the car to retain more charges with this now it's sure it's sure i will cover more more distance with it i will cover more distance with this uh, it's a little dis discovery and i'm trying to share it with everybody one it will reduce the stress on your component in the car and two it will help the car to add more energy into the battery and thereby you can travel longer distance with with, with nissan leaf it's a it's, it's something that i that's worth sh sharing and that's why i'm sharing with everybody please like share and subscribe uh, let me show you the mechanical device again sometimes to open this thing with one hand oh, man. here's the mechanical device uh, and I have it onto my power line the power line goes outside and I keep my EVSC right here this is my EVSC right here this is my EVSC that I'm using so I just uh, okay. Has the EVSC right there? The EVSC is I kept it right there. The power cable to the EVSC is this goes into this guy. The reason for this is because this is a 240 volt or 220 volt plug, and this is 110 plug plug. So I had to introduce this in to make this thing function in between in and out of it and it goes to the wall from from the wall it comes out. This is it right here. You can see well not the yellow cable, this cable. This is for my 220 outlet. This is a 110 outlet. I can use any of the two. It's 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 amazing to discover some things and that really help in making the car go longer. In as much as still hiding, I don't have no problem, and I'm not stressing the battery. I'm just trying to see that the memory effect of lithium does not lithium battery does not set in. But I try to bring it up to the maximum we can get. Right now, it just disconnect. It just finish charging, and I can actually unplug it. 
let it rest. That, I don't know. Let's go and see what we have on the leaf spine right now. Okay. Okay, so it went back to 95.6 percent state of charge and well 19.7. Okay, let's plug it again. Let's see what's gonna happen if we plug it again. What's gonna happen if we plug it again? I don't know. Let's see. Will it, will it go up? I don't think it's gonna go beyond this 95.5 percent maximum 96 percent yeah I don't think so but it's okay let's see the State of health of uh, focus, man. State of health of uh, ninety point three two percent and three hundred and ninety four volts, which is not bad. Okay. Okay, I'm out. Have a good one. Please like, share, and subscribe.